right, so in your cursive letters book, page 57, you can go ahead and begin on page 57, just practicing your cursive. You can begin. Page 57 in your cursive letters book. Uh, phonics and language, page 181. We'll do our dictation, 181. Phonics and language, page 181. Okay, so we have two sentences. Huh? Is it this? Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. So we have two sentences that we'll be writing for dictation. You have one on the top, one on the bottom. Okay, let's begin. 181. 181. 181. Yes. Okay, top sentence. Ben's dog rested on a rug. Ben's dog rested on a rug. Be careful how you write Ben's. That's a possessive. Ben's dog rested on a rug. Go ahead and write it. I'm not repeating it again.
All right, let's do our second sentence on the bottom. The children sang. The children sang. The children sang. All right, do we have those two sentences? Yes, both of them should have started with capital letter. How should I have wrote, how should I have written bins? Yes, I had to have B-E-N apostrophe S because bin is a possessive. Are you on the first one? Huh? Are you on the first one? Uh, I gave the first one and I had just gave the second one. Thirteen, thank you. Six plus seven, thirteen. Elijah. No, I'm gonna my Seven minus two is five. David. Three 
Zero. There are many. All right. You would just find the way you have a couple other things. Number 10 is going to go over our coming by 10s. And then go ahead and get us letters located. 70, letter V. So letter V, page 70. All right. Let's get started with our dictation on 183. But yeah, we, since we lost the day yesterday, we're doubling our pages today and tomorrow. So just keep that in mind. You'll have double pages. All right, let's go ahead. So I'll say a word to write the special sound you hear in the word. Okay, pretty easy. First one, stop. What's our special sound in stop? Stop. Um, 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 that's good. That's fine. Good. Sounds like you had a good time. All right, stop. What's my special sound? Stop. 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 Stop.
Okay, how do we spell sparkle, Naraya? Uh, not, not quite. S P A R K L sparkle. All right, let's go to the bottom row. We'll have another dictation sentence. Okay, we named our fish sparkle. We named our fish Sparkle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we named our fish Sparkle. Elijah, if you can, I'm not gonna keep asking you to keep over and over again. Hmm. Okay. All right. We named our fish Sparkle. That should have had a capital letter and a period at the end. Good. All right, guys. Let's go ahead and look at the board. We'll cover a couple of things on the board, and then we um, will be done for our morning portion. We don't have language as well this week, so we'll come back for math and um, not writing math and science stuff studies later. So look at the sentences up here. So they say, it says, Jenny picked up her dolls, puzzles, and books. And this one says, bananas, oranges, and strawberries are my favorite fruit. So we've discussed this already in writing, but you'll start to see this in your phonics and language book. We talked about when we write a sentence and we're listing several things inside of a sentence. What do we put in between those things that we are listing inside of that sentence? Commas. We place commas between those things. So when do I stop placing the commas? What word lets us know that we don't need any more commas? What word? And so Jenny picked up her dolls, puzzles, and books. Where would I need commas at for this one? Dolls and puzzles. Dolls and puzzles. And then I need kind of a period, a period at the end. So anytime, just as a refresher, in case you may have forgotten, anytime we write a sentence where we are listing things, listing a bunch of things inside of the sentence, we place commas between them to separate them. In this case, we talked about the things that she picked up, which were her dolls, puzzles, and books. This one says, bananas, oranges, and strawberries are my favorite fruit. In this sentence, we are listing fruit. Dennis, where would I place commas in this sentence? 
bananas. Okay, and after and bananas. Oranges, and after and oranges. oranges. And that's it. Bananas, oranges, and remember, guys, when we see and, that lets us know we don't need any more commas because we reached the last one. Bananas, oranges, and strawberries are my favorite fruits. Good. So you will see commas in a series inside of your books, but I just wanted to refresh you guys. Sorry, it seems like you remember. Good, but just in case anyone had forgotten, that's what we do when we run across a sentence where it's listing things, we place commas to separate those things. All right, let's go ahead and do some board work like we normally been doing. All right, so I have closed, Faith. I would like to make it closing. What would I need to do to it in order to Take off that Take off that Good. Next one. Okay, the word is smoke. Let's turn it into smoky. Take out E and add just one to the wire. Good. Next one. All right. Stare. Let's turn it into stared. Next one. Check me. I have to Okay, take off E at E Z. Good. Next one, bake. Let's turn it to baker. What's the rule? What's the rule? Eight. Take off the E, add E, R. You did it. Anchor. Oh. All right, next one, Dennis. Can you tell me you need the word? We're just we're just reading. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Dennis, not yet. Carson, what's the word? Refill. Good. Next one, Dennis. This word. Build. Build. Next one. Avaya word. Relax. Relax. Next one. Okay. Built. Okay. Kenley. Take take that out. We read that one, but you weren't paying attention. This one, release, and then last one, Araya. Five. Okay. All right, so I have the singular cat. How would I make it plural? What would I do to make this cat plural? What do I do? Add an S. Add an S. 
cat. Okay, what about bush? Let's make it plural. What do I need to do for bush to become plural? Yes, bushes. Good. All right, go ahead and get out your spelling, list 17. That's our list for this week, list 17. We'll cover spellings now since we have a little bit of time. Spelling list 17, page 34. Can I tell you to stop playing with that? Problem. Why do I keep having to tell you the same thing? No. Okay. All right, let's look at list 17. So we will not have any uh, Greek or Latin this week. We'll focus just on our words in our book so that, because like I said, we have a shorter week. You only have a few days to focus on it, okay? So number one, afar. Afar. A. A. F. A. R. Two, almost. 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 Three, besides. Besides. B. E. S. I. D. E. Four, enlarge. Enlarge. E N L A R G E. Five. Untie. Untie. U N T I E. Six. Wrapper. W R A P P E R. Wrapper. Seven. Wood. Wood. W O U L D. Eight. Around. Around. A R O U N D. Around. Nine, always. Always. A L W A Y S. Ten between. Between. B E T W E N. Eleven, enjoy. Enjoy. E N J O Y. Happy. Happy. U N H A P P Y. Unhappy. Thirteen, right? Right. W H W R I T. Fourteen should. Should. S H O U L D. Should. Fifteen went. Went. W E N T. Went. Sixteen gone. 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 G O N D. Gone. Seventeen stay. Stay. S T A Y. Stay. Good. Tell your vocabulary. 18 pledge. Good. P L E D G E pledge. 19 phrase. Phrase. P H R A S E. And phrase. And a part, part of, of a sentence. sentence. And 20 Christian. Christian. C H R I S T A N. All right. So that's all we're doing. Don't just your 20 words in your book, okay? All right, guys, y'all have a good break. I'll see you later for math, spelling, and social studies. Sorry, math, science, and social studies, okay? Bye-bye.